Okay, so I'm going to share how I match my blue bottle fires. Okay, so first you're going to want is a container, preferably large enough to uh, for the flies to have a bit of room, um, like this one, um, which obviously will fit in the front door, which comes in handy when you want to get rid of them. Um, or you can use just your deli cup or a boreal keeper as it is. Okay, so first things first, we want to add some wood shavings, which is just your basic rabbit or hamster crap. Uh, so just want to grab a bit, just put it a little bit in the bottom. Um, this will just stop the maggots from getting, or the uh, casters from getting too damp and not hatching. Um, so you don't want a lot of that, but just enough really in there. Uh, then your next step is you want a jelly pop, uh, which is on Amazon. I think they're about uh, £17 for 40 of them, or a lot of the sites have them for about 50p each. Uh, depending on how many casters you want, you're putting in. Um, it's just a, one or two spiders that you're feeding. One should be enough. You just peel off the top and <clears throat> be careful it doesn't squirt in your mouth, uh, as someone found out. So you just pop that in there. And then final step, just add your casters. So this is only for a couple. So you only want probably about 10, 20 or so. Uh, obviously you will have some which don't hatch. Uh, the longer they've been in your fridge, the less time, the less likely they are to hatch. Then all you need to do is just give it a quick little squirt. Again, not overly damp, just so it's slightly damp. Um, not, this will just wake the casters back up. And then all you wanna do, uh, which is totally optional, is just get a little twig or something and just stick it in there. It just gives the flies something to perch on. Uh, and obviously stretch their wings, um, which then prolongs the life of the life of them, and that's pretty much it. Then you need to put it somewhere warm and where the light is, uh, which is what I find the best. Um, so you can tend to put it on your windowsill, or I just keep them on top of the fish tanks, um, so the heat from the fish tank will give them. Um, and that's pretty much it and then you have that so <clears throat> take about a week to two weeks to, for them to hatch uh, this one was done last weekend and I think in there somewhere is there's one or two flies in there somewhere um, so they've just started um, these ones start hatching about a week or two the jelly pots in there will gut load the flies um, so it'll help keep you keep your flies alive and obviously the nutrients that the fly eats will then get passed on to your spider. And that's pretty much it.